Hey everyone, welcome back to Ambitious Nature, and today I will be going over the uh, slow motion effect. And without further ado, let's jump right into it. So this is a fast way of doing it. What I like to use is speed change. Uh, beforehand, what I would do is click this, and I believe they have change clip speed. You can do it this way. This is, if you're still, like for me, I, I find myself diving between the two. They are literally the exact same thing, whether you're doing clip speed change or you're doing speed change. Um, it is the same thing. But again, I'm just using this tab because it is very easy and I want to streamline your process. So if you click over here, as you can see, this clip is smooth. It's playing back, this is in real time. Um, granted, it's grayed out, it's in log, that's a whole other video, but we will dive into it later. All I'm doing right here is going over to my speed change, pressing 50, and I kid you not, it is this simple. Now, it's in slow motion. Now, because it is choppy, it looks a little bit too bad. This is shot in, I believe, 24p. Let me see what the metadata is. Yep, 24, so it's not gonna look the best on here. Um, but, let me go back to Inspector. Let me drop it to maybe 80, tab it slower. And you kind of get the picture. It's slowing it down a lot more. Um, you can still choose your duration. Uh, if you ever have an issue, you can uh, freeze it or you know go back to the uh, the frame on here. If you press the reset, it'll go back to normal. You get the picture. You can, you can slow up your footage. Um, now, if you want to, I believe, let's go to 50. Let's go to motion blur. So right here at the bottom, you could add in motion blur. Bingo. And motion blur will start to smooth it up a tad bit so that it is not as, let me turn, let me go to my effects and turn it on and off. Um, this is the 50 without the motion blur. It's kind of choppy. Um, and with motion blur on, it smooths it up just a little bit. So. You can kind of fake slow motion. I'll, I'll do a I'll do a separate video on a um, on a quick fix, like a, well, I guess a more effective way of doing a super slow mo if you don't have the the expensive cameras that can do it or the right codecs. Um, but this just gets you in the ballpark in terms of slow motion. So that's it for the video, and I will be back again with another one. Peace out, you guys. See you later.